What's nice about convolution is that it allows us to solve ODEs where the right-hand side isn't even part of our Laplace transfer table. And in order to do that, let's solve y double prime minus 4y prime plus 4y equals tangent of t, where y of 0 is 0 and y prime of 0 is 0. And the thing that gives it away is tangent of t, which isn't part of our Laplace transform table. In particular, be super careful the Laplace transform of tangent, which is the Laplace transform of sine over cosine, is not the ratio of Laplace transforms. Because remember, Laplace transforms behave very badly in terms of multiplications and divisions. So all we can really do, we can consider Laplace of tangent, just uh, symbolically. And well, just as before, the steps are the same. So take the L, the L, and then what we get is Laplace of Y double prime minus four, Laplace of Y prime plus four, Laplace of y is Laplace of tangent of t. There's nothing we can really do with the right-hand side. We leave it as is. And then we can use our uh, miracles. So s squared L of y minus s y of 0 minus y prime of 0 and then minus 4 s l of y minus y of zero and then plus four l of y is Laplace of tangent of t. And once again, remember the initial conditions are zero. So all those pesky terms become zero. And we're left with, I think, s squared minus 4s plus 4l of y is l of tangent of t. Once again, sanity check. This left-hand side is the auxiliary equation. This helps. And then l of y is one over s squared minus four s plus four Laplace of tangent of t. And now what's the idea? Well, Laplace tangent of t is already a Laplace transform. Let's try to write this left-hand side as Laplace of something. And then we can use convolution. That's the game plan. Not too bad, so let's look at 1 over s squared minus 4s plus 4. That is 1 over s minus 2 squared. And as usual, this is a shift now, so this is a shifted version by 2 units of 1 over s squared which remember is the Laplace of t. And so one over s minus two squared becomes, as usual, we have this extra exponential term. So L e to the two t times t. But let's just write this as L t to the two. That kind of ODE form. And this is good, we wrote this one over s squared minus four s plus four as a Laplace transform. And now the last step is just to combine everything. So L of y now becomes L of t e to the two t times L of tangent of t. And then use a convolution theorem. 
So that's the same thing as L of T e to the 2t. Stop. Tangent of t. Of t. And so what is our solution? Well, y is t e to the 2t convolved with tangent of t. And again, please write this as an integral. So integral from zero to t, t minus tau, e of two, t minus tau, tangent of tau, tau, d tau. And that's good because we have a solution. The bad news is, well, it's in terms of the integral, but unfortunately, this is really the best we can do unless somehow you can evaluate the integral explicitly, which I don't think you can do here. Um, but still, it's good because you can, for instance, put this into Desmos or Wolfram Alpha, and they can act, at least give you an approximate graph of what the solution looks like, which is cool. And this is really if you want sort of the most general way to solve this, if you're okay with integral solutions. In the next video, there's a little surprise goodie. <laughs>